Hi guys, it's Darren at Green Pro Clean, window cleaning and property maintenance company in Derbyshire and Nottingham. Uh, today we're talking about rope access work and uh, how to store your ropes at the end of the day. We do quite a bit of rope access work for jobs like roof cleaning, high access, so on and so forth. And uh, at the end of each day, this is how our ropes end up, stored in a bucket like so, which is perfectly adequate. Some people use uh, a, a professional rope bag, etc., that you can buy from any uh, climbing or access shops. Uh, but what we do is we coil our ropes up into nice coils, easy to store away, ready for the next job. We don't use our ropes daily. If we did, a storage solution like this would be fine, but as we don't, we like to get them away tidily because we only break them out three or four times a month at the most. We use the Mamut ropes. These are a 10 millimeter professional grade rope. You can buy them in any length you like off the internet these days. They come in uh, this particular one, 70 meters, uh, but you can get 100 meters, 50 meters, whatever you need. But always remember that it's better to have too much rope than not enough rope. But anyway, what we're gonna do is, now that we've had our rope packed away, we've actually cleaned it, it's been dried out. We've been through it inch by inch, taking a visual check, making sure there's no tears, no rips, no, uh, no cuts in it, and that it's perfectly safe for the next guy to use to get up on the roof. So we're gonna start with the two tag ends, and what we're gonna do is line them up nicely. Here's your two tag ends right there. And we're gonna stretch them out, full arm's length, and then over the back of the neck. This will come down to the waist on this side. Now we're going to leave the tag ends hanging there and we're going to pick up the other end of the rope and we're going to pull it out like so, so you've got a loop there. That'll go over the back of the neck so you've got the whole loop there and then just leave that at your waist. Now we're going to do the same again in our left hand over here, same side where the tag ends originally started out and let that down. I'm going to speed up a little bit because otherwise you'll get bored watching the video but this is literally just repetition, repetition, repetition. And, uh, reason that I'm going to speed up is because I don't actually know how to fast forward feature on the video when it works yet, but uh, don't want to bore you too much, let me crack on here, I'll be right back with you in just a moment. Here we go, keep it going, all the way to the bottom of the bucket, another two or three coils here. Now we've got here, what you're going to notice is whilst this one's waist length, this side, I've got just that little bit longer, double, double down to my toes basically left. So now that we're there, we've got our two sides, we're going to pop that over the head, like so, bunching it all up in one hand, and we'll take this longer length here, this is going to come round the bottom, once, twice, oh, looking myself up good there, three times round, and that's going to tie it up like so. And now take your, your, your loop here that you've got left over that you've wrapped around the middle and bring it back through the middle of your ropes, like so. This one might be a bit tight because I do like mine quite tight. But now you've brought that back through, you can use that to hang it on your hook for your storage or just double it over the top, whatever you want to do. But that's literally uh, how we store our ropes. These little straps available from any of the car dealers, outdoor shops, etc. Little Velcro fastening straps here with the mood ropes you get a free one with each rope anyway but they're quite handy so we're just going to finish this off putting it away in storage for next time just by popping that strap uh, get it the right way up so I oh, say you can't see this but uh, you're just getting the strap up on there popping it round bringing it round velcro it off and there we go there's your ropes already neatly stored away for next time Hope you found this uh, informational, educational, and hope it keeps you found a bit tidier. Thanks for watching.